It won't be easy. But I think it's the only option we have at this point. Agreed. We must inform the Commander immediately. Go right ahead. Commander? Central? The Shadow Chamber has completed its analysis of the Avatar's DNA. It has identified the genetic sequence necessary to travel through the psionic gate. Perfect. We can finally shut this Avatar project down for good. However, the gate requires more than a mere transmission of genetic data. The sequence has to be part of a live subject. The key only works in lockstep with the signal. We don't have time to find another one of those things, let alone capture it. No. That part we can handle. We make our own. You're serious? Quite. Though the specimen before us is damaged beyond repair, it has provided us with its complete genetic blueprint. We already possess an unaltered avatar template from the Forge facility. That combined with the genetic material we recovered at the Black site should allow us to replicate the procedure here. So, what's the catch? Yes, that. Without an elder consciousness driving it, the new avatar would remain as lifeless as the one before us. While I can develop its body, I cannot create the mind to drive it. But I can, in a way. By manipulating the new avatar via the psionic network. You want to operate one of these things? by remote control. Not exactly. And definitely not me. Interfacing directly with their network would cause severe, if not fatal, trauma to an unprepared central nervous system. As it stands, we only know of one individual who has survived that kind of ordeal. That was different. The stasis suit created the perfect interface to the network, one tailored to your specific biology, Commander. Of any human candidate, you are the most likely to survive the connection. Most likely is not good enough, Doctor. It is the only answer I can give you, and our only option to traverse the alien portal. We need to come up with a game plan before we charge through the enemy's front door. We'll give you some time to think about this, Commander.